We're hatching chicken eggs, and the best way to see if anything's living inside these eggs is to candle them. Unfortunately, one of our incubators came unplugged, and we're really unsure if the chicks are alive. We put eggs in two separate incubators seven days ago, and today is time to find out if they're fertile or not. We're using the Nature Right 360 and also a new incubator that I purchased on Amazon. I'll leave a link in the description below for both of them. Okay, here's our first egg. So it's not fertile. So, so far this isn't looking good. Okay, so here's egg number two. It does look better. I do see some veins. I don't see my little dot that I'm looking for, but I do see some good veins. Now this is a Easter egg or egg and it's kind of dark, so it's hard to see on this one. Okay, here's our next egg, and we can immediately see that it does have a little embryo in there. It's a little dot in there, and there's some good veins, and this one is really, really looking great. So I'm so excited. Finally got one that I can say it's there. It's living. All right, here's this one. Now, this one looks sort of odd. The air sac is kind of larger in this one than it was in the other eggs. I do see veins, so we're going to put this back in the incubator and um, see what happens. Again, this is a dark egg, so it's hard to tell. Here's another olive egg or dark egg. I do see good veins. So we're done with our Amazon incubator. I put 10 eggs back in the incubator. That was 10 out of 12. We had to remove two. I'm pretty sure about six of them. So on to the Nature Right 360. Let's candle those eggs and see what we have. Okay, so we're gonna use the light from the Cell Novo incubator. This egg is out of the Nature Right 360. I do see veins. Again, this is a colored egg, so it's hard to tell sometimes on the colored egg. It does look like there might possibly be something in there. There are some veins right here. I'm gonna put this one back because I'm unsure. By day 14, we should be able to tell if this one is alive or not. I can see this one. It may be kind of harder to see on the camera because it's a darker egg, but I do see a dot right here. This egg looks more like it's supposed to look when it has a chicken in there. There's definitely a dot on this one. You can see it moving. This is a lighter brown egg, and you can see the chicken so much better in those. It's alive, look at that. That's just amazing. This egg, I wasn't sure if it was gonna do anything. It's kind of big, so I wasn't sure about it, but it, it looks like it's got a chicken. It's got a dot here. This is a darker egg, hard to see, but it's definitely got a little dot moving around in there. A little small egg here. Let's see. Definitely looks full, like something is happening, but I can't see the veins and I can't see a dot. We'll leave it in the incubator or till day 14. And on day 14, if we see no activity, then we'll remove it. Definitely got a chicken in that one. It's moving around. It's amazing that seven days from now, you'll actually be able to see the little legs moving. That one too. It's alive in there. Now, if you wanna see how these eggs look as we continue candling on day 14, click on this video.